The championship game from Honolulu, Mele Kalikimaka. On this Christmas day, Santa's ready. We're ready for Houston and number 21, Washington, as the Cougars have beaten Portland in Georgia Tech to get to this championship game against the Huskies. The 21st ranked team in the country has knocked off Ball State and the home team, Hawaii, to get to this championship game. Luck gave fits to Hawaii in the semifinal matchup from the start for UW. They really did, but also remember that this is a team that's capable of playing man to man. And of course, the Cougars come in as one of the best rebounding teams nationally, top 10, but giving up offensive rebound on the first possession with him. In the lane, here's White again. Georgia Tech, 15 points, 12 rebounds, so he's been playing very well in this tournament and with a tremendous amount of confidence. Quade Green, an open three. First is shooting the ball extremely well, as well as distributing well for this Washington team. And an answer from Nate Hinton. Game is starting, Rock. It looks like these two teams are here to have some fun. Of course, we're going to have fun talking about them. But the offense early, 7-7. Seven, seven. And both teams firing away. Um, now when the ball goes up, they're pretty much sending everyone back on the defensive end of the floor because they respect what Houston does in transition and getting out and running. Back-to-back -back threes from Jaden McDaniels. And it's from Caleb Mills. Grimes picks it up, pass inside. And Isaiah Stewart swatting Bryson Gresham. Mills attacks and scores. But you also see the way they love to get out in transition. And one of the reasons why they're so good in transition is because Isaiah Seward can run the floor and seal and win because he's the only player that's going to outlet to someone else. Everyone else, when they get a rebound, they're going to push it. But if they get the rebound, that means he's running the floor. Very few bigs are going to keep up with the big floater player. from Caleb Mills because it's not like a regular 2-3 zone. And it's very hard to simulate because of Washington's length and size as Jaden McDaniels on the drive. It's Donald scoring late to knock off BYU in a tightly contested game here in Honolulu yesterday. Quinton Grimes a three for Houston. Dejan Giroux, 12 for the Cougars. And Justin Gorham in. Here is Gorham. And that's the area where you have to be successful against the zone, but you can never relax against the Huskies. We look at the top 50 recruits that have played here in the Diamond Head Classic this year alone. Michael DeVoe had 16 points with Georgia Tech in the game earlier, and then of course four in this game alone, so heavy talent that Jamal Bay knocked down the three ball. Sasser, the floater on the baseline. And nice dribble. Sam Timmons with the left hand. The team at BYU that Mark Pope has. And a much improved WCC. Count it and one, Fabian White Jr. Isaiah Carter, three. Washington is now six for eight from downtown. Got many good looks, of course, when you go for 23 in the first half against Georgia Tech. He's at the top of the scouting report for the Huskies. But he's going to have to be more aggressive on the offensive end of the floor because the zone is so far out on the perimeter. You look at Jay McDaniel, who's actually back line of the zone, but he's beyond the three-point line. And not only do they... Auto coming up with a huge win over Dayton. The Dayton yeah. Flyers are really, really good. That's a big win for Colorado and a great win for the Pac-12. And a resurgent year. You know, it's much easier to come back in the second half and play against it. The lob for Isaiah Stewart. Fouled and one for the freshman. Attempts in the first half, but the, eight, the six free throw attempts is where he was able to score the majority of his points. Fabian White gets the roll. Bucket. The follow, the attempt from Isaiah Stewart. Quade Green chases it down. Again, Stewart finishes inside. Isaiah Carter tracks it down. Attacks Quentin Grimes. Carter lays it in. Love his aggressiveness. Yeah. Fabian White Jr. with 11. That's Houston. You've got to get that defensive transition back and set. Oh 
Baby and White again. Line enough props because when you think about what Gorham as well as Fabian White and Chris Harris Jr. have done this game matching up with this big time front Chris line. Chris Harris the tip. Underneath and a slam, Chris Harris. Of Washington and came out in the second half and said, we're going to show you as they have been quad day green. Marcus Sasser, a three. All three of those guys have been productive and bring something different. You've had Mills, you've had Sasser. Count it and one for Isaiah Stewart. And speak. Quentin Grimes, three. Down the lane and a kick out for the lead. Houston's on top. And right now we've got a great one coming down the wire. 11 minutes remaining and the stars playing well. Hamir right hanging and from those drives and stopping him from attacking the basket. Caleb Mills, the pull up. That's a three. Nazaya Carter answers with a three. You might be searching for the ghost of Christmas past. <laughs> Nazaya Carter, a three. Side 10. Inside, Fabian White, career high tying 17 points. And stand up like a strong announcer that you are and take the responsibility of that turnover that you forced the broadcasters, Jinx. Absolutely. My defense was impressive forcing it. Isaiah Stewart and one. Shoot. Caleb Mills, double clutches. And the follow for Justin Gorham. Hands of Isaiah Stewart, who's once again been their most productive offensive player. Grimes. Justin Gorham hits a three. The lob for Isaiah Stewart and the reverse. Far for the Cougars. But two minutes to be able to change that. Here's Stewart inside. Off balance, gets the roll, and one. The Huskies have gone back to the zone on this possession. Caleb Mills gets the roll. Here's Stewart. Isaiah Stewart inside, two-point game. Isaiah Stewart against a man-to-man -man and allow him to continue to work. Timeouts. Quade Green, pull up three. And the rebound, there's Grimes, and he's fouled by Hamir Wright. Possession game. And the Huskies looking as though they've let one slip through their fingers, a game where they had control of early in the second half. Up 14. Quade Green on the drive. Gets inside, and the bucket. Quentin Grimes. He took a finger to the eye, but he's the brother of a longtime NHL player. <laughs> Tyler Myers, the defenseman for the Vancouver Canucks. The follow, Nazaya Carter. And with 1.4 to go, Houston in bounds. That'll do it. And the Houston Cougars are champions of the 2019 Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Head Classic. Hard fought game. Great job by both these teams. Highly competitive.